today I'm going to make char siu chicken with Chinese fried rice. Let's start. In a large bowl, combine together the garlic, 5 spice powder, soy sauce, sesame oil, ketchup, hoisin sauce, and honey. Stir very well. Now add mixture to your chicken. Make sure your chicken are coated well. Set aside and let it marinate in the fridge for at least 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, lightly oil your stove top grilling pan over medium high heat. If you don't have a grill pan, you may use regular non stick pan and grill the chicken facing skin side down to achieve a beautiful grill marks. Cook each side for about 5 minutes. As you can see, the color of the chicken has turned golden brown. It is normal because of the color of our marinade, but it is not done yet. It's still raw inside. I'll transfer the chicken to a baking sheet pan lined with aluminum foil or parchment paper. Place the chicken in the baking pan skin side up. That way, all the fat juices from the skin will go to the meat and it will make your chicken tender and very juicy. Baste your chicken with your marinade before baking. Preheat your oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit and bake it for 15 minutes. Also basting the skin with sauce halfway through. While baking the chicken, I'll start making my version of Chinese fried rice. Heat oil in wok or skillet over medium-high heat. Add garlic and cook for a minute. Add Chinese-style sausage. I didn't put too much cooking oil in the beginning because the sausage is very fatty and oily already. The oil from the sausage will give a meaty flavor to our rice and veggies. Now we can add our frozen mixed veggies. You can definitely use fresh veggies and slice them to your preferred sizes or shape. Stir and cook the veggies for 2 minutes and then add the spring onions. Add two and a half cups of steamed rice. Mix and make a little well at the center of your pan and add your eggs.
Add salt and pepper as well. And stir until well combined and egg has dried up a bit. Mix well and turn off the heat. The eggs will continue to cook as it cools down. Now I'm going to take my chicken out of the oven. Slice your chicken to your preferred portion. Look at that perfectly cooked chicken, tender and juicy. Place your chicken in a nice serving plate and drizzle some sesame seeds. Our dishes are ready! My version of char siu chicken and Chinese fried rice. Perfect for family gatherings or friends' potluck parties. Happy eating!